Have you ever had one of those days where you just were doing everything wrong? One day, I put all my dirty clothes into the dryer, and uh, that didn't work. <laughs> it, you've got to wash them first. There has to be an order in life. And I know that I set some of the stains in that shouldn't have uh, happened, but it did. Well, just as we do not place clothes in a dryer before we wash them, we do not serve dinner before we prepare the food, and we don't build a house without a plan. We do not pick fruit from a tree before it is ripe. In ordinary, everyday things, we recognize the law of first things first. If we want to live and move and have our being in divine order, we must put first things first. Now, how do we do that in daily life? By putting God first. By having that as even writing it down on a sign, which I've done before, God first, it reminds you. It reminds you that before you do anything, go to God first and realize that we live and we move and we have our being in God. We're able to rejoice in the knowledge that because we have our being in God, we are a part of the divine order that is part of God's world. To know that you are in divine order and know that in God you live, you move, and you have your being. Any lack of order, it just vanishes. First things come first. And you know what? Life is made easy. Life is made smooth. And we're able to enter into life in a new enjoyment of the moment. I pray today that you are in divine order. I pray that you know that in God you live, you move, and you have your being. I pray today that this is a part of your life. God first. First things first. And your whole day will turn around in divine order.